Softlock Registration This presentation will give you an overview on softlock registration. In BSI, basically there are two types of registration. One is hardlock registration, that is security check will be done through a physical security device dongle which needs to be inserted in the USB port. In case of softlock registration, a security file is provided to the user and users are required to copy that file into the C BusyWin folder. From that particular file, security security will be checked, that is Busy will read that in which version or model Busy is to be opened. In this presentation, we will discuss about the softlock registration and other related issues like in case your softlock file gets corrupted, then what needs to be done or in case you want to install Busy on some other computer, then what is to be done and all such issues related to softlock registration. So the first case here we'll look is that how to register softlock when you have internet on your system like you are registering softlock on that particular system on which internet is available and you are registering the softlock for that particular machine only. For this you will open busy, go to company menu, license management and softlock registration option. Here first of all you will specify that you want softlock registration for current machine or from some other machine. In our case we will select the current machine option and then softlock to be bound with that is you want to bound softlock with hard disk or your machine id. You can choose any of the option we have taken here as the machine id that is this particular softlock file which we will specify will be bound to this computer's machine id. Next you will specify the serial number and activation key of the busy package provided to you. After providing these two information, click validate serial number button to validate these details. If you have entered a valid serial number and activation key, then the registration details box below to these options will get activated. In this box, you are required to enter details related to your trade and the busy package. Busy is installed by an invoice date, your organization name, trade description, address, telephone number and all. After this box, you need to enter the email ID. Please note here that you must enter a valid email ID and your running email ID that is the email ID you are using currently and the registration password and recheck password. Here we are mainly focusing on email ID because the security file will be sent to you on this email ID and all further communications will be done on this particular email ID only. Now click register button. On clicking the register button, Busy has also shown the message box that please check the email ID that you have entered a correct email ID because security file, softlock security file will be sent on this particular email id next which is asking that shall i proceed for softlock registration click yes button on clicking the yes button registration successful message box had appeared this is showing that busy has been registered successfully and the security file has been mailed on your email id now we'll open our mailbox here we are opening a gmail in the mail you can see various details as entered by you during the softlock registration at the bottom of the mail are file is being shown below which a download button is appearing click the download button to download the softlock security file this particular file will be downloaded in the download folder on my computer now you will go to my computer downloads folder here you can see a file with the dot busy extension this particular file is your softlock security file you need to copy this file and then paste it into the c busywin folder on the screen you can see we have copied this file and pasted it to the C BusyWin folder. Now after pasting this file in the C BusyWin folder, Busy will now read all the security details from this particular file. Now you can see on the screen that Busy has not started in the demo mode. It has read the security file and now it will run in the EC mode that is whatever the mode specified in that particular security file. Next, we will discuss the case when you want to register softlock on a computer on which no internet is available. In case you do not have a internet on a particular machine, then you can register softlock for that particular machine from some other machine. For this, first of all, you will open the busy on the computer on which there is no internet connection. Go to company, license management menu and generate system info option. On clicking the button, busy will ask you that do you want to generate a system info file? Click yes button. This system info file with an extension .bmf will be generated in the C BusyWin folder. After clicking yes button, you can see a message box on the screen that system info file has been generated and kept in C BusyWin folder. Now you will go to the C BusyWin folder, copy this file that is on the screen you can see a file with .bmf extension and paste it on the computer from which you want to register the softlock that is the computer which is having internet connection. Now again on this particular system 
on which internet connection is available you will go to the company menu license management soft lock registration option here now you will select the option for some other machine because we are registering soft lock for some other machine after that you will specify the path of the .bmf file that is the file you have copied it to this particular system you, if you remember we have copied the file at the desktop now we'll specify the path of that particular file and enter the required details as we have discussed earlier also on entering the details you'll click the register button and soft log registration will be done for that particular machine same registration process will be followed a file will be sent on your email id and you need to copy that file into the cbusyvin folder of the computer on which there is no internet connection Next, we'll discuss the case. If you don't have an internet connection on a machine for more than 19 days, then busy will run in demo mode. In such a case, you need to do two things. Either you can provide internet on that particular machine and revalidate the soft lock file, or you can get a duplicate license file by using the get license file option. So first of all, here we'll discuss the case that we are providing internet connection on that particular machine, and then we will revalidate the soft lock license file. On the screen, you can see a message box is appearing that busy will run in demo mode as it has not find internet connection for more than 90 days. In such a case, you will provide the internet connection on this particular machine and go to license management revalidate softlock license option. On clicking this option, busy has shown a message box. Click yes button in the message box to revalidate the softlock license file. An important point to note here is that it is mandatory to have internet connection at the time of using revalidate softlock license file option otherwise this option will be of no use now we'll discuss the case when you cannot provide internet system on the particular machine and you'll switch to some other computer and generate a duplicate license file for this you'll go to license management option get softlock license file option here you'll provide the serial number and your registered email id the email id you have provided at the time of softlock registration and the password on providing valid details you will click the get license file button on clicking this button you can see a message box that license file has been sent on this particular email id another point i want to mention here is that in case you forgot your password you can click the forgot password button to get your password next case we will discuss is that if your license file gets corrupted then what to do in such a case you will go to the get softlock license file option provided under the license management again so here we can see the get softlock license file can be used for obtaining a duplicate license file either in case you are license file has been corrupted or you want to revalidate the soft lock for some other machine on which there is no internet connection so for both the cases you can use the get soft lock license file menu basically this menu is used to generate a duplicate soft lock license file after that another option change soft lock email password is also provided in case you want to change the email id or password as provided by you then you can use this option now we'll discuss the next case that you want to install busy on some another machine this is a very important and critical step i can mention like in case you want to install busy on some another machine then what to do such a case you need to surrender your current softlock license file and re-register the softlock i would like to mention here that if you are formatting your computer then you do not need to surrender softlock file you should use surrender softlock file option only if you are installing busy on some other computer or you have changed the hardware of your computer apart from these two cases there is no need to use the surrender softlock file option in case of formatting you just need to copy the softlock license file to some other computer pen drive or some other drive which you are not formatting and then format your system and copy back that file to the cbusyvin folder there is no need to surrender the softlock file in case of formatting on clicking the surrender softlock file option you can see on the screen busy is also showing the message that use this option only if you want to install busy on some other computer or you have changed the hardware of your system totally after clicking the yes button in the message box you need to specify the serial number registered email id and the password and click ok button to surrender the softlock license file click yes button in the message box and now busy is showing a message box that softlock license file has been surrendered successfully busy will now switch to demo mode after surrendering the softlock file you need to follow the softlock registration process again that is we have discussed earlier also you will go to the softlock registration option and re-register for the softlock 
another important point I would like to tell here is that you can surrender softlock from any machine. In case your computer is not working, it has got some problem, that is the computer on which softlock is registered has got some problem, then you can surrender softlock from any machine. It is a very good feature, that is you can surrender softlock from any machine which is having an internet connection. So these are some cases which we have discussed. After that, we will discuss some questions that users frequently ask us. First question is, is it necessary to have internet to use softlock? No, it is not necessary to have internet, but it is recommended for smooth working. If you have internet, then softlock will get validated automatically. But if you do not have internet, that softlock will stop working after 90 days. And after which either you can revalidate the softlock file or get the duplicate softlock license file from some other computer. Next question is, I want to format my computer. Do I need to surrender softlock and re-register again? No. As I have said earlier also, in case of formatting, you do not need to surrender the softlock license file. Next question is, I want to use softlock on another computer. What should I do? In case you want to use softlock on some another computer, then you must surrender your softlock license file and re-register softlock. Next is my computer got damaged, how can I surrender softlock? I would like to tell here is that you can surrender softlock file from any computer where busy is installed provided you know your serial number, registered email ID and password. What is the difference between softlock registration and get softlock license file? Softlock registration option is used when you are registering softlock for a computer whereas get softlock license file option is used to obtain a duplicate license file. In case your license file is corrupted or you have lost your license file then you can use the get softlock license file. Next is what if my license file gets corrupted then you can use the get softlock license file option to get a duplicate license file. So in this presentation we have covered about the softlock registration and various issues related to the softlock. Hope after going through this presentation you would be able to easily register softlock. Thanks for watching. For more videos subscribe to our YouTube channel.